We've had two straight losses after our eight victories to begin the year, but we can fix all that easily today because today is Otani Bump Day. Hey, what's up, guys? It's CJ, and welcome back for another episode of Rewriting the Season with the Los Angeles Angels. We are 8-2 and two on the year now after two straight losses in our last videos. If you're new to the channel, check the description. We have all the rules for how we're playing this, and make sure you go back and watch our other uh, videos in the channel and get caught up on what we're doing in this series. Today's episode will feature game 11 of the season for the Angels, Otani's third start, which was a two nothing victory over the Washington Nationals, including a one hitter by the Angels, seven innings from Otani. Let's check the lineup for today's game. Not a lot of changes from our previous games. Taylor Ward leading off in left field. Mike Trout in center. Shohei Otani will be on the bump and the aching. Anthony Rendon playing third. Hunter Renfro in right field. Luis Rengifo at second. Jake Lamb back in the starting lineup at first base. Gio Urshela at shortstop. And our catcher batting ninth is Logan Ohapi. Like I said, Shohei Otani, that Angels team captain card, will be on the bump for us today. So far in the series, two complete game shutouts and i'm no mathematician but if he does that again i'm pretty sure we will snap our two game losing streak all right our last two games uh, last two losses have dropped us below 400 so we're right in that 350 to 400 area i believe that's still an all-star and today we're going to be facing uh the charisma fergie jenkins level three but we are the home team once again Ground ball to first, should be pretty easy. 92 speed, but Jake Lamb's gonna get there. 0-2, let's see if we can go with that backdoor cutter. We we miss our spot, but we get the strikeout anyway. Two way in the first. Rocking the 99 Corbin Carroll. Ooh, first pitch swing in, lines out toward. We're out of the first. I didn't realize it, but I think he's got like a full uh, Diamondbacks lineup he's rocking. Respect to it. First pitch, oh man, we get over the top of the sinker. I didn't even look at what Fergie offers. Elevated sinker up in the zone. Oh, and it bounces off the foul pole. I think that was a double either way. I think he had the shift on there too. Double for Trout. Oh, the fork ball. I thought I'd sat back on it enough. Ah, we need to time that up better. Yep, still early on that. Okay, two down now. Oh, and another inside sinker. We just don't get a good piece of it out of the inning after the trout double. Hmm, bummer. Popped him up. Yeah, we're just going right after him now. I was trying to get cute earlier and paint corners, but he's just swinging over the top of everything, so I might as well just throw pitches out of the zone. And that fastball hangs right in the middle of the zone, but he doesn't time it up. Pop fly to right. Through two, no damage. Oh, another sinker. All right, we need to figure out that sinker. That's uh, three ground balls on sinkers when we think they're fastballs, so we gotta adjust. One one. Luis Rangifo, now we are one player of the game from being able to upgrade Rangifo after the 97 Rangifo drop today in the Kaiju program. Gives away exactly when I'm recording this, but yeah, 97 Rangifo dropping in the Kaiju program again today. So we are now one up upgrade away from that card. Get through. Nope. Super dives are still in play. Oh! Throw pulls him off the back. Jake Lamb is safe. They're going to score that a base hit. He might get his average over 100. Oh, good pitch. Forcing fastball. Gets the corner, and he gets out of the inning. Oh, they changed it back to an air. No hit for Jake Lamb. He's still hitting under 100. Uh, that walks on me. That walks on me. I should have been throwing. I got cute. I went upstairs. I went inside. He has a good eye for that, but he's swinging over the top of everything low. Get there, Renfro. All right. And he misses on the bunt with the stolen base attempt. Why does everyone do these stupid plays? This is not how baseball is played. And he swings over the top of strike three, and now we're out of the inning. Get down. It won't. Judge is there, and that's the first out of the third. 
Good timing on it. Well, it's a little early, but wow, that went a lot farther than I thought it was. I thought that was just a regular pop fly and it ended up being a jumping catch of the wall. Two down here, but we got Trout up. Smashed by Trout, but right at the third baseman playing towards the line. Gets out of the inning, one, two, three. We still got about 15 pitches out of him in that inning, so we're still progressing nicely where we want in the pitch count. There we go, nice and easy ground ball. Woo -hoo -hoo. Backdoor cutter freezes him for the second out of the inning. That's my favorite pitch in this game by far. Oh, he sits back on the curveball, and of course he plants it into the into the gap with 99 speed Corbin Carroll. And that's gonna be a triple, I think, unless, oh, good relay, got perfect throws. Just couldn't get there on 99 speed. There we go, we get the strikeout, we get out of the inning. The triple doesn't do anything to us, we're through four. All right, Otani, help yourself out here. Oh my God, I didn't get a piece of that. Just an easy pop-up for Rendon. We gotta get him going somehow. We gotta get some player of the games with Rendon or he's gonna be stuck at silver for a long time. Get down, no, super dives. Super dives, my favorite. Fastball right on the black, gets the strikeout looking. Second strikeout looking for Otani so far. Get there, Lamb, nope. All right, base hit for Brooks Robinson. You don't see that card very often. He's not liking that fastball on the corner. It's two strikeouts looking in this inning. There we go. Nice and easy grounder back to Otani, and we're through five. Now there's a new Kaiju Rangifo out now, 97 overall. So a player of the game with Rangifo, that will definitely help him be player of the game. A player of the game with Rangifo, we can upgrade to a Diamond Rangifo. That would be huge for the Angels lineup. Get down. With the shift, is he gonna get there? Oh my gosh. I think he's got that 99 speed Corbin Carroll in left. So yeah, he's gonna get to that ball. And a drop, nope. Another weak pop out to the outfield. That's two down. Oh, fastball pretty much right down the middle. Just miss it off the PCI. Good timing though. But he's out of the inning. But Rangifo does get us on the board. The solo home run for Luis Rangifo. We've got a 1-0 lead. And with Otani on the mound, that might be enough. Oof, good swing. All right, he's starting to sit back on that curveball. I think that might have been out of the zone, too. Ah, oh, these 99 speed guys are hitting the gaps. I don't like it. Leading off the, the sixth, right after I said that might be enough, one run might be enough, he leads off the inning with a, with a double with a guy with 99 speed. Oof, that fastball went right down the middle. Tag up. Come on. Oh, ho, 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 we get the perfect throw and everything. How did we not get that? Okay, now I feel like he's going to squeeze here. It's not a squeeze, but the ground ball does get the run home. Maybe I should have brought the infield in. And that's the first run we've given up by Shohei Otani in the entire series, literally right after he said it might be enough. So that's on me. Nope, Rangifo got a weird, like he moved to his right first. I think he might go. Runner, runner. All right, fastball, we quick pitch on the fastball because I figured he was gonna go with the 99 speed. We throw him out, we get out of the inning, but they do score the run after the leadoff double. Ah, that one hurts. We got a hit now, top of the order though. Ah. Yeah, that one's right on the black too. I thought that might have gone below the zone, so I was trying to check my swing. Either way, that's either a strikeout or a pop-up on the check swing. Oh my goodness, the fork ball. Man, he's working that in right times. I'm, I'm just not seeing that fork ball. And I'm not touching it either. Oh, and he goes to the sinker. I thought he might go to another off speed. He's really working, mixing his pitch as well. We only have two hits. Get the fly ball with Judge. Now Otani is into the yellow, so I am gonna warm up some guys in the pen here, but I'd like to go as far as I can with Otani while I have a diamond pitcher on the mound. Oh, 
Oh, I don't know why it gave me Ward. I thought that was a, I thought that was an infield pop up for sure. Glad thing, good thing I was able to switch over to Urshela and get the out. Oof, he got a good swing on that one, but I think it's gonna die at the wall. Yep. All right, Renfro makes the catch through seven, actually six and a half. We're going to the bottom of the seventh. One one. We still only have two hits. First pitch. Ooh, he dives. I think he probably could have made that play if he didn't dive. But we get a base hit, lead off the inning with Rendon on first. Come on, Renfro, make him pay. Oh, baby. No doubt about it, we make him pay. Perfect, perfect with Hunter Renfro, that Kaiju series card, and we're in the lead. And I didn't replay that, he did. But that is a beautiful swing there by Hunter Renfro. Watch it go, 435, we'll call it 108 off the bat. We got a 3-1 lead here in the bottom of the seventh. And he's bringing in the lefty Andrew Chafin to face Luis Rangifo. And he throws the first pitch right down the middle and I miss. Ah, weak grounder to third. He doesn't dive for this one and throws him out. And that's just the first out here in the seventh. We've already got two runs on the board. Pinch hitter for Jake Lanham. Bringing Brandon Jury into the game here. Face the lefty. And it didn't help whatsoever see get that one on the ground geo nope ton of speed out in the outfield and left and center for him catches it gets out of the inning but the big two run homer by hunter renfro gives us a 3-1 lead going into the eighth inning come on trout get there get there get there get there and a boy Let's go right after him well not the spot we wanted but it's the result we want. It's an out. Brett Phillips. What is this Brett Phillips card? And do I need to get this Brett Phillips card on the team? Home run. The first home run we've given up by Otani in this entire series. And he's going to replay it. Okay, he replayed ours. He's replaying his own. Respect to him. We still got a 3-2 lead here. But now I'm wondering, do we have to get the pen going and get them into the game? He's putting good swings together on uh, on Otani now. I might have to go to the pen here. I'm going to go to Wance out of the pen here. That's going to end the day for Otani. I wanted to get him through eight. He's hitting 615 with that Corbin Carroll card. Hopefully we can get out of this inning because I'd like to get a lefty on him. Oh, please. Oh, please make the play. Okay, we get out of it. All right, we still have the lead. We're going to the ninth. At least with a lead, hopefully we can get some insurance runs here, bottom of the lineup, going into the top of the lineup. Bringing in Joe Kelly out of the pen. And he's got two lefties up in the ninth, so I've got Aaron Loop warming up to come in. One pitch, one out. Logan O'Hoppy not going to get it done there. Top of the order coming, though. Oh, Taylor Ward, get all of that one. 88 power, perfect, perfect. Over the bullpens, we've got a two-run lead back. Some insurance runs moving into this ninth inning. Over the top of the curveball, which is what he was doing most of the game. He's probably thinking the same thing for me that I'm thinking of him. Just throw stuff in the dirt and he'll swing over the top. Ooh, and he, he, he checks the swing and we get the walk. Brings up Rendon again. Let's see if we can get Renfro up one more time. Interesting. He went with the fastball on the first pitch, so I thought maybe I could go. He'd go. He'd go off speed second. We get. We guess right. We guess right on that second pitch. We get the stolen base with Otani. Oh, is that a no doubter from Anthony Rendon? Sits back on the curveball, puts it into the bullpen. It's a six-two game now. I might have to think about leaving in Wance, try to get that save, but I'll probably still go to Loop even with a four-run lead, just because he's got two lefties coming up. And that's going to be a ground ball for Renfro. Gets him out of the inning, but three more runs on the board. Tons of insurance. We got a 6-2 lead going into the ninth inning. And really, player of the game is totally up for grabs right now. We are bringing in Aaron Loop. Four-run game in the ninth here, but he's got a couple lefties coming in. Oh, get there, Rendon. Pops him up. One away in the ninth. Quick and easy first pitch grounder. Two away, we're one out away from getting back in the win column. Down to his final out, he's bringing in Paul Goldschmidt to pinch hit for Gunnar Henderson. Bringing in the righty to face the lefty. 
Ooh, good swing on it, but it's not gonna be enough. That's gonna get caught by Renfro, and that's a 6-2 win for the Angels. We are back in the win column, 9-2 and now. Otani, 3-0 and in the series. Lots of home runs for us there. Player of the game could be anyone. And the player of the game is going to Anthony Rendon, two for four with a home run. Those last two runs in the bottom of the eighth secure the player of the game for Anthony Rendon. I was not expecting that, but Rendon gets a player of the game. Now, right now he is a silver card, which means we can upgrade him to a gold. I don't believe there is a gold Rendon, but there are two different diamond Rendon. So now he is one player of the game away from being upgraded to that first diamond, which I believe is a 92 captain from the uh, April tops now it's a nationals card but it is an upgrade for Rendon once we get upgraded to that card one more player of the game we can get the incognito Rendon it's also a nationals card but there are two diamond Rendons available so far so that'd be a great upgrade for the team if you made it this far in the video thanks so much for watching drop a comment drop a like Make sure you let me know what you're enjoying about this series so far. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We're trying to do three new episodes of this series every single week for you guys. Also, don't forget to follow us on Twitch. We are going to start going live again soon, uh, probably next week, picking up a, a decent schedule, moving in uh, up, the, up the ranked boards on our main account, as well as some uh, BR runs as well. So make sure you drop that the uh, drop a follow there on Twitch. The link is in the description of this video. Thanks so much for joining us. Another episode of Rewriting the Season. We'll be back soon. Take it easy.